டேசல் இட் இஸ் மெயின் பை ட்ரைட் அனாலிசிஸ் பை அசோசியேஷன் எவல்யூஷன் அண்ட் லிங்கேஜ் இட் வாஸ் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் டெவலப் அட் பக்லர் லேப் பை எயிட் பக்லர் இன் கார்னல் யூனிவர்சிட்டி இட் மெயின்லி இன்வெஸ்டிகேட்ஸ் த ரிலேஷன்ஷிப் பிட்வீன் ஃபினோடைப் அண்ட் ஜீனோடைப் எயிட் இன்வால்ஸ் கே நேமர் ஜாயினிங் அல்காரிதம் ப்ரின்ஸிபல் காம்பனன்ட் அனாலிசிஸ் ஜிஎல்எம் அண்ட் எம்எல்எம் GLM and MLM are useful for associating phenotype and genotype. Downloading and working on TASEL TASEL can be downloaded at www.maisgenetics.net. There we can find TASEL 4.0 standalone version. Click on the link so that it, it gets downloaded. Let us know how to save the data file. In genotype data, the markers are arranged in row and the tags that are analyzed are arranged in column. Now, this excel format has to be saved in another text format. Save as give a name to the file and select text tab limited format. Save the file. Click OK. Yes. For progression. In the same way, phenotype is also saved. Here, the trait is arranged in row and the tags are analyzed or arranged in column. It is also saved as tab delimited format. Follow the same procedure. Now, the TASL workable area is open from the extracted files. The TASL work area contains three functions, data, analysis and results. From data, we can load the input files. Load the genotype and the phenotype data. After loading, we can find the genotype is in sequence form and the phenotype in numerical form. The genotype has to be transformed to numerical form to transform select transform from data function. Select option collapse non-major alleles and create data set. The genotype collapse data is now in numerical form but this has to be transformed again. To transform this data, we apply principal component analysis. Select the number of components, for example 2 in this case. Select create data set. We can find PC for genotype collapsed data. Select it. Along with it, select phenotype and genotype data and this has to be integrated. Select intersect join from data. Now we can find the three data are intersected together. Select it and go to analysis function and select GLM that is general linear model. Use permutation test for markers. If 
you have to filter the output based on p-value, select the option or else say OK. Here we can find the GLM is constructing. Now, after the GLM has constructed, we can find the associated data. Select it and tabulate the results. To tabulate, select result and select table. To tabulate the results, select export CSV file. Give an appropriate file name and save it in .csv file. Open the results there we can find marker p column and its corresponding permutation values. On considering 5% level of significance based on permutation values, certain markers are found to be associated with pseudo blackstock disease in wheat. There are 10 markers are found to be like that. Here, those 10 markers are 11007, 11008, 2248, 1075, 6870, 9583, 2255 Thus, Tazel is helpful in marker trait association. Tazel applications are association mapping, linkage disequilibrium, diversity estimates. These studies are helpful in genetics. Thus, Tazel is helpful in genetic studies. Thank you.